In the previous checkpoint, you have seen the result of connecting one diode to an AC circuit. You obtain a half-wave rectification. Now what if you want to rectify the entire waveform of an AC circuit? There's a pretty ingenious way to do this and it is known as the full wave rectification. Confused as to how this is possible? Let me show you how it is done. Let's consider this circuit. Four diodes are connected to a low and an AC source to form a bridge rectifier, as shown. When the current from the AC source is, is in this direction, at this junction, diodes A conducts current in the forward bio, uh, bias, while diodes B are in reverse bias and do not conduct current. As you can see, as you can see here, hence the current through the load is downwards. Similarly, when the current from the AC source is in the other direction, diodes swap, so diodes B conducts current and diodes A do not conduct current. Notice that current through the load is in the same direction for both cases. This can be represented graphically. For the first half of the period, the current passes through diodes A and taking downwards to be the positive current direction, no changes occur to, this, to the current in this section of the graph. For the second half of the period, the current passes through diodes B and similarly taking downwards to be a positive current direction, the current through the load is still positive and of the same magnitude as the one provided by the AC source. In other words, this negative part of the graph is rectified to become positive with the same magnitude. This first half of the second period is similar to the first half of the first period. In this way, we obtain a continuous current flow through the load in the same direction, although the potential difference varies, following the same shape. Let us look at another example again, the sawtooth AC. Based on the graph of current against time, the full wave bridge rectification simply flips all the negative current to a positive current with the same magnitude. As such, 